Hi everybody, it's me, Susan, and I didn't get everything out that I wanted to get out. How dare me. I got some things I wanted to show you. Um, I've been talking about. First off, I was telling you about my little um, Helping Hands LED light that I got from um, Harbor Freight. Yeah, I haven't used it yet, but it is pretty nifty. Um, whoops, sorry. This is it. And it, the light is really good. Um, and then the magnifying, you know. So I'm going to set that down like this. And, uh, and it's got the arms, which I just kind of moved around because I don't think I'm going to be needing those. I'm just mainly going to be using it for the magnifying light um, for my jewelry making um, and I'll turn that around and show you all that in a minute sucks getting old also I told you that I had put this on my phone I got these charms they were just flat on the back I got these from April in a pinch she got them on eBay and this is the way they came and this is what they look like on the front and then this is the back just flat like that and I had some um, I had bought this uh, findings jewelry from Amazon and it came with um, all kinds of little stuff for earrings and so I had these post so this is what I made and this is it you can you see my little crab on my ear so yeah and then um, I just guess I'll leave these like this um, I had made here it is something let me see if this one fits. I had just sat down and made a few little, um, little, you know, jewels, the beads and stuff that I put together. Well, this has the, you know, to put a charm or put it on earring, hoop, or whatever. So I have these earrings here, which this just flips up in the back like that, that I got it. Tarjay for like $4.99. There were three sets. I got this and then there's a bigger one that I don't even wear. So I took this and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to make some and um, put them on there. What do you think about that? I was thinking about putting it on this one, but I think this is like too long. So I thought this might be a little bit better. So if you had um, the hoops like this, and you just wanted to have, make it like a little different type earring or a little bit dressier. You could add some beads to it. Um, so that's that. So I got your crab and then you got your pretty little dangly thingy on there. But you just have to make sure that when you um, make your loop on there with this, that you just make it big enough, you know, kind of have it back here so that... Um, it'll slip on here like this so yeah that's nice I thought that was pretty cool or I guess you could put you know numerous ones on there these are actually I didn't make these these are earrings I got from Donna great power 60 y'all should go back over there and um, if you're not subscribed to her subscribe to her she's awesome I love Donna she lives she's in Canada so this is just some little um, findings that I bought at, um, hey Max, that I had bought at uh, Michael's that were on sale. I got those for $1.99. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. What else did I buy? They're not in here. Then I do have these little charms. If I ever made pocket letters, I could hang those on pocket letters, huh? Jamie Padgett. She's always on me about um, making pocket letters and I just can't do it. 
So that's that. And I did make some blue earrings that I showed to a friend that I'm going to send to her. And then I wanted to make some more, quite a few pairs to send to another friend that I love and that I need to send something to because she has just been so, so, so nice to me. And I haven't, I bet about that, people. You all have sent me pocket letters and all kinds of things that I haven't got back with um, thank you cards or any type of little thank you gift. But this is something that I also ordered. So I'll take this time personally to say thank you very much. I put some uh, mascara on and I was going to put some lipstick on. And guess what? I have no lips again. So anyway, um, thank you so much for the pocket letters and the friend mail that everybody has sent me and the giveaways. Like I said, I'm really bad about... Um, I'm going to get... I'm going to change that, and I'm going to start sending out some cards at least. I want to try to send something, a little trinket of some sort that I make to um, my lovely friends. But, um, excuse me, my nose is itching. I'm red. You, this is, this is um, calmed down quite a bit. When I got up this morning, I looked like a lobster. I looked like I was flipping, had got sunburnt yesterday. My whole face was just blood red. Almost as red as this thing here. Um, I guess from that prednisone that I'm taking. It's bothering me. I didn't sleep well. So, anyway. I have to take four of those for three days. And I have a very, very sensitive stomach. My mom also had that as well. And I find that I do a lot of things that are, I'm just a lot like my mom was with a lot of things. Um, so I'm having difficulty taking the medication. But anyway, we're going for it. So I'm just taking a pill here and there. i got to take four of them today and four tomorrow. And then I go to three for three days and then so on, so on, so on. But I don't like the prednisone. It's not very good to me. I also got these for $1.99 at... Um, Michaels. Did I, or did I get these at Hobby Lobby? I don't know. No, I didn't get them at Hobby Lobby. I got them at Michaels. Yeah, and they were um, a dollar ninety nine. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these yet either. But I just thought they were kind of neat. Figured I could find something to do with them. I'm really enjoying this, and I have yet to sit down. Dad isn't mad. He's out there cutting grass. I guess you can probably hear him cutting grass the wind's kind of blowing it's finally stopped raining for a bit for the past two days it's rained here and there but um yesterday it didn't really rain a lot it just here and there but it mainly looked like oh we were really going to get hit with a storm so okay so yeah but um i don't know if i showed you i bought these at the dollar tree to put some of this mess in i mean gosh I, people i have got a mess and i need to get so organized and then i bought these little they were twit instead of 10 in a package for a dollar there was 12 so i got these little um containers that i thought would be nice for you know i could and I could um, set them. My sister got me, remember, the box, the boxes from Tuesday mornings, and I had my stamps in one, and I kind of started putting my mess in there, but I figured if I um, sorted out my beads and stuff, like I have some angel wingy things in there that I had ordered from Amazon, and I have those in there. So I thought, you know, if I put my stuff in there that I could, um, keep it a little bit more organized. Stephanie, I need you to come and organize my stuff. I fixed, I made that too. I thought that was kind of pretty. I just sat down. I was watching a channel one day. That's mainly what I've been watching lately is, um jewelry making and how to's and stuff and then I started going on Pinterest and um, just pinning a bunch of stuff 
not necessarily it doesn't even have to do the you know have a I like YouTube better because I like the videos um, but some of the pictures that I took um, that I pinned some of the pins that I took I figured you know at least I have the picture and I can look at the picture and try and get an idea there and see gosh man my jaw is just lopsided <laughs> Anyway, um, I'm just a uh, hot mess today. Uh, everybody gets on here and says they're such a hot mess, and I'm like, no, you're not. And here I am. I'm a hot mess. Um, <laughs> got my hair. I've messed up my clip. I do like this with my clips and these that I have on, and I have quite a few of them, and it breaks the middle one because I press too hard to try to get it in there tight. I've got one that's really super tight that I really love. And I go, here I go, bouncing off the walls with different stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm into my jewelry and I had made this bracelet and I thought I'd, I just got these on there. Oh, as um, I made the little, this one's kind of stretched because I've been wearing it 24 seven. I've had it on for like four days. Because I'm chain, I bought this chain stuff, and I want. I'm the type of person. I think I told you in another video that I put jewelry on and I leave it on, and I don't take it off. So I'm testing. I haven't had any green marks on my arms. I've lost a couple of the beads because they've got stuck on the door when I was letting the dogs out, and. I found one in the bed, so it must have got stuck on my shirt because I didn't change my clothes. I was sleeping in my clothes, and I had some, like, lacy stuff. So, um, yeah, I'm trying out this chain and um, to see how it, you know, it's not, doesn't seem to be turning any dull or yucky which this is, it's actually a little bit too big. I could probably take it to about there and it would still, well, maybe not that far, but anyway. A lot of babbling going on. Um, I'll have my planner video up Sunday. Um, other than that, I've just been dealing with the ear stuff and um, Dad getting over his little fit um, he seems to be doing okay, but we're not mentioning the trip. Um, so, um, I tried to get a plan together with my sister. Um, we have one day, well, possibly three days if David stays home on his days off. He's off three days. He's off on Sunday and Monday, and he's off on Wednesday. I'm leaving on Saturday and coming back on the I'm staying nine days, so I'll be back on the, I'm leaving on the 4th, and I'll be back on the 13th, so David's off on Sunday and Monday, I leave Saturday night late, around 8 something, um, and then I'll be getting home around 4 or 5 in the afternoon on Monday, um, so he's off on Sunday, Monday, and Wednesday, so that's three days, and then on Friday, my niece is off, so she said she could come over, so that's four days. So I still got five days that need to be covered. Um, uh, I was told we have a month to figure this out. I would like to know now, you know, but other people don't work that way. So um, I had it planned out and I talked to it to him about it. And he was like, yes, that's fine. Then he changed his mind. Um, and didn't want to do that so um, that's where the problem came in um, he's concerned about who's gonna cook for him who's gonna clean um, my concern is him taking his medication him eating um, my sister can come over after work and spend the night um, she said possibly maybe she will take a few days off I don't know. She works um, 
she has the luxury. It's not a luxury to her, but a lot of people don't have this opportunity. But she can also work after, you know, different hours than what they're open. So um, that's, you know, a big help for her, an advantage for her because her husband is sick as well and she has to, to take off to take him um, to Lexington to the doctor and things. He goes down there to UK. And um, so uh, I don't know. But anyway, um, I hope they can get it figured out and I hope everything's okay. And I'm going to try to go. And when that plane lifts off that runway, I'm going to just let all that, I'm leaving it behind. I'm not going to worry. Right. Um, and I'm going to have a really good time. I'm going to do my best to have a good time. So, I've got to still, you know, today's the 6th, almost, you know, a month still, but it's like, wow, that could get here, because, like, the months are going by so fast. My nose is itching. I guess it has to do with that medicine. I don't know. But anyway, um, I just had been talking to you about my helping hands. I believe this was $8.99, and it was well worth $8.99 so far from what I've seen. Like I said, I haven't used it, but I've, you know, um, and it comes with the batteries, so that was good. Three AA batteries, goes in the light, bouncing back and forth here, because I'm fixing to get off here, because I'm at 16 minutes, going on 17 minutes. My videos are getting too long. Um, I need to go get some Mountain Dew, so I need to do a Mountain Dew run. I'm looking for the better place to get them, and I guess that's going to be Walmart because none of the grocery stores have them on sale. Everybody's got Coke on sale. What's up with that, Corey? Corey Scherer. Um, she's also a Mountain Dew freak, too, like me. So, um, yep. So, I hope everybody's doing all right out there, and... Um, I will, I should do a um, Who Have I Been Watching video. Marnie, it's Friday. Are you got big plans for the weekend to do absolutely nothing with me? <laughs> she had commented it's the weekend. You know, I talked about the weekend in one of my videos, and I don't ever have any plans. It's just another day to me. Big deal. Oh, happy Mother's Day, everybody, this weekend. I'm not, like... I never did understand my mom not wanting to celebrate Mother's Day after she lost her mother. Because it's like, gosh, Mom, you're, you know, you're our mom. So there's still reason to celebrate. But my mom's gone now, and I totally get it. I totally understand. Prayers out for uh, Casey. Doesn't do videos anymore, but she was Casey late, Lady Boss. I don't know if she still watches my videos. She doesn't comment, but anyway, um, she recently lost her mother, so this is going to be hard for her. Carlene Samples, um, her mother just passed away. So, you know, um, there's a lot of us motherless ch children out there that um, will be missing our mothers on Mother's Day and burying our head in the sand or in the pillow or whatever. Um, so my heart goes out to you. Um, I'm sending big hugs to you because this will be my second Mother's Day without my mom. So it's hard. So you that have mothers, make sure you give them an extra hug from us motherless children because we don't have our mothers anymore, unfortunately. It's kind of hard to believe that they're gone for good, that they're never, ever, ever coming back. That's kind of hard. It kind of hits you every once in a while that, you know, they're gone. They're not coming back. But they're in a better place, and they're healthy, and they're pain-free, and they can breathe, and they can run, and jump, and dance, and sing. My mom liked to sing, and my mom liked to dance, so... I'm sure she'll be up there dancing and singing away. So that's going to be it. Um, thanks so much for stopping by. And welcome to all my new subscribers. I have 610 subscribers. I'm trying to figure out when I'm going to put that uh, giveaway in there and what it's going to be. I have no idea. 
So, um, thanks for stopping by, and um, I sure do appreciate each and every one of you, your love and your support. Gosh, we're in 20 minutes already. Okay, all right, already. Thanks. Welcome. And um, don't forget to uh, spread a little sunshine. Bye-bye.